Welcome back to another quick tip. In this video, we'll quickly go over model sets, how to set them up, and why they can be really helpful. Model sets is a feature available to users of Keyshot Pro. It's a tool that allows you to save independent scene tree variations in a single bit file. So if you have variations of a product, or you'd like to better organize multiple components, or maybe you'd like to experiment with different compositions, you can use model sets. There are a couple ways to do this. You can add a model set by clicking the Add Model Set icon, where you can give it a name, choose what to clone into the model set, and check off other options like link materials. You can also right click on a part in the scene tree to either create a new model set or add to an existing one. Or you can choose to create a new model set upon import. In this case, I'm bringing in a grip for these phone cases, and I'll add the part to its own model set. Don't forget to create a name and render the thumbnail. So now it's easy to toggle on and off the model sets that I want active in the real-time view. I can turn on this phone case with the geometric pattern, or switch to the simple colored case over here. I could look at both of those with or without the grip, or just work on the grip independently. If I wanted to, I could also just open up this group of two and continue to add models in here, or rearrange the layout without altering the other model sets. The idea of using model sets is really nice because it feels like you're opening a new scene each time. But really, it's all nicely packed up in one file. You get all those cameras and environments which you can toggle through for each model set. And you can use model sets any way you'd like. These are just a couple of examples. It's a feature that is easily adaptable to your personal workflow. You'll definitely see better organization of your scene tree, and you'll also simplify all of your work in just one file. The other nice thing, model sets easily lead right into the configurator. So it's a nice workflow practice that will help you make use of this really cool presentation tool. So if you've been bouncing around through different files or trying to hide unhide a long list of parts in order to achieve what model sets can do, I really encourage you to check out Keyshot Pro for this awesome feature. Thanks for watching this Keyshot quick tip. Leave a comment below with your thoughts and don't forget to subscribe for more helpful content. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like and share it with your friends.